Oh, I'm feeling so unmotivated today. But hey, savages, things aren't gonna fix themselves. Let's go. All right, so last week I replaced my front sprocket, rear sprocket, and chain. However, it's the first time that I riveted a master link uh, before. And you know what? I think there's a whole lot of videos of how to do it right. I'm actually gonna make this one that tells you, you know, how you do it wrong and fuck up. So problem was is that I didn't have a measuring tool to actually really tell how far apart the chain link itself is, which is around 19.2 millimeters wide at its thing. Um, and then you're supposed to, you know, with this Motion Pro PBR chain breaker, chain setter, chain riveter tool that I have, supposed to press it in just enough and then press and rivet. Uh, but I over pressed on the rivet, uh, causing one of the sides of the rivets to crack. Uh, so that's in and of itself a failure point, one that I don't want. So I'm gonna break it again. I'm gonna try to reset it and do it correctly. And I did measure uh, my master link and it was at 18.4 millimeters. So it was actually too tight and I wanna get it as close to the other links in the chain as possible. All right, so I got the Motion Pro breaker on. Ordered a couple more master links just in case I fuck up and I have a clip one just in case I am just so dumb I can't get this to work. All right, it's a little difficult and boring to film this and shoot, but I popped the old link off. I've put the new one on. I've set it and this is looking pretty good. 19.10 millimeters for the original chain and then Damn, I knocked this one out of the park. That is lined up almost exact. That's how set rivets should look. Looks good, rides good, I'm out.